Okay, so when you first walk into my room, that was just a sign on my door that says my name and my apartment number. And then this is just a quick overview of the room as a whole. So my room is basically like the main room and there's a little nook for my desk. And then my bathroom is also connected to my bedroom. So you have to go into my room to get to my bathroom, which is really nice. Okay, so when you first walk into my room to the left, I just have my full length mirror. And then next to that is a picture that I found on Wayfair that kind of matches the theme and all the colors. It's just black and white flower. Next to that is my nightstand, which I also got on Wayfair, and it's just mirrored, and I have some faux roses and Chanel book, and I think a Cartier and Vanity Fair book on top of it, and then I just have some of my stuff stored in the little drawer there. So my bed is also all black and white, and my Hermes blanket is actually a look-alike, and I think it's from Etsy. I'll try and find the link, but I'm not usually great at that. And then I just have some little throw pillows and the pillowcases that came with the bedding and then some satin pillowcases on the back pillows and the headboard is from Target. So here I have all my purses hanging up or some of my nicer ones and then that's next to my desk area which is kind of sparse right now but I have a clock and then some of my nicer boxes up here just for decor and I haven't really started class or work yet so I don't have much but I have my computer and my agenda and then my current bag and I also have my Louis Vuitton suitcase and just a little weekend or duffel on the side. So this is just kind of an overview of that little nook area because it's hard to see from the front door of my room. So taking you into my closet, it's kind of a disaster because there's not a ton of room, but there's some shelving and then all my hanging clothes and at the bottom there's just some space for other things that I didn't have any other room for. So up here I just have some other designer boxes and then backpacks, toolkits, extra hangers, shoes, just kind of random stuff like that that I'm just basically using this area for storage. And my clothes I tried to organize really well. I did it by color and then length of sleeve and then over to the left is just kind of random stuff and pants. But I really tried to make this look good and had like all matching hangers and everything like that. So we'll see how long that actually looks nice. And then underneath I just have laundry and random bags and casual shoes. So this is my bathroom and it's kind of barren so far, but that picture is from Hobby Lobby and then pretty much all of my shower stuff is from Target. So I kind of went with the same theme like black and white and gray in here as you can tell. And yeah, I just have a picture and then some little things on the countertop like a candle, some perfume and a David German bracelet. Again, I didn't really want to do much in here because I use this space a lot. So I just kind of kept it clean and nice looking. Okay, so super long story short, I moved out of the apartment I was in first semester and I now live in a different apartment in the same apartment building. So a lot of the stuff that you would have seen in my video, like the bedroom that I sh like showed, was in my first apartment and literally looks pretty much the exact same here. It's just a different room. Um, but some of the stuff that I originally had in the bed, my bedroom there, I put in the living room here. So if you see stuff that you that looks like it was in there before and in here now, that's why. Um, I'm not gonna explain that situation, but basically I live in a different apartment, but in the same building now. So here we go. So this is the main area of the apartment. Obviously, as I said, this is not the same as the one that I was living in first semester, but so if you see some of the stuff in here that was also in my room, it's because I moved it in here and now my room looks not that exciting. There's Bennett. Um, so anyway, yeah, so you walk in and there's all these windows, which is super nice. Um, and then the first thing I have over here is my little bar cart. I don't have any wine right now, but I just have wine glasses and then roses and a candle. I don't know why I thought that I should decorate with dinosaurs, but I spray painted some dinosaurs gold and so they're all throughout. I don't know, I was bored. Um, and then in here is the kitchen. So you go in and I just got this little runner from Home Goods and it's all like granite, which is nice. And then dog treats, knives, cabinetry and stuff, obviously. I have this little flower and then another dinosaur and a little marble plate and then a picture of me and my friend right here. Um, and then just normal like kitchen stuff. And then I tried to recreate the Oreo stack thing and it went pretty well actually. It looks kind of cool. Obviously they're not gonna be good for very long because this is an airtight so not super edible. But um, up here I just have all my appliances and then random like boxes and bags. This is just a little lamp that I got I think online maybe. Um, or at home goods, I think online. Um, and then this little stand. And this is my living room. All this furniture came with the apartment, it came furnished. So I just had to get like little decor type things. So I got this rug, this obviously isn't real. Um, it's a fake little like 
cow rug or something and it has like gold flecks which is I thought was really cute and then this is my little TV setup I used to have boxes again and then um, <laughs> my boyfriend built this little Lego thing so it's there but um, this is Bennett's toys extra blankets and then this little seating area with the two chairs that also came and again another little dinosaur and a candle and just some like decorative books and a little box and then this is the little couch area I feel like there was originally supposed to be a dining room table here because it looks like a dining room table light, but I don't know. I didn't get one, so this is where we're at. Hi, Bennett. Um, so yeah, it's just a couch. I have my computer and then all my books and stuff for school are over there and this little like green plant thing. But yeah, it's like a cool little view of this park over here and then this is like a storage building, so. But I always have all the windows propped up just a little bit so even when they're closed, Bennett can like go look outside because otherwise he gets like anxious in here. Even though I don't leave him in here very long, but he likes to look outside. Um, and then the last thing is just this little mirror which I had in my old house and I have some of my purses hanging on it and then my little clear purse for games and stuff. So it's just like a full length mirror. And then yeah, that is pretty much it for this main room. I'll just give you guys another once over. And then yeah, this is my room. Kind of a disaster because obviously we're in quarantine. Like it's not really a disaster, it's obviously really clean, but there's kind of crap just like pushed to the sides and stuff. So I can show you guys that at a different time, but right now it's just not, there's just like tons of stuff all in there and over there. But it's pretty much the exact same as my old room, except for it's just set up a little differently. So anyway, there's that.